treating gum disease with the periolase laser has really been a revolution in how to manage someone's gum disease. When we treat someone's gum disease with the laser, the laser fiber tip is first inserted into the gum pocket, and the laser is so precise that it kills the bacteria and destroys the diseased or inflamed gum tissue while leaving the healthy tissue untouched. So we use this beam for pointing, and watch as I fire the laser, how the laser doesn't interact with the white paper at all. Now watch as I bring it over the black lettering. You see that popping. Each pop represents the laser interacting with the toner on the paper. The laser only removed the toner, but did not disturb the paper underneath. The analogy is in the mouth is that the laser removes the diseased tissue and kills the bacteria in the pocket, but leaves the healthy tissue undisturbed. It's the most precise instrument we have. If you think about conventional cut and stitch periodontal surgery using a scalpel or stitches or scalers, the finest instruments that we have still cannot differentiate between healthy tissue and diseased tissue. And that's why those procedures many times result in more recession and more discomfort afterwards. But the pinpoint precision of the laser uses physics to do what we can't do with our hands and it removes only the diseased tissue but leaves the healthy tissue undisturbed. I urge you to call my office to schedule an appointment for a consultation. We can discuss how implants can help you achieve your oral health goals so you can smile better, feel better, and enjoy life more.